<laughs> That's a great way to start. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? It is yours truly. Um, so, to start things off already, <laughs> it is eight, almost 8.50 in the morning. I barely got any sleep, and my hair looks like a train wreck. I am built like a train wreck, so if I have the dry voice, please forgive me, because I'm still trying to shake off the tiredness. But with that being said, uh, let's cut straight to the chase. So, as you guys know, um, I've been teasing a little project here and there. Um, now this project, um, I've talked to my, I've talked to my group channel about this. Uh, I've talked to my buddies, um, and they, they seem to be on board. And, um, so I've decided, you know, as, as much as I try to keep this, um, on the down low, like under wraps as much as possible, I just might as well, um, give you some info of what this project is. So... I'm just going to give you the entire blueprints of the idea. So that being said, let's get started on this project discussion. So to start things off, the, this project, um, there, there's still some developmental stuff going on with it. Um, I do have part of a script written out already. Um, I do have the characters that I need. Well, most of them. I still need a few more for me to have this whole, have the whole series, you know, um, ready to get up and running. So this project, um, I'm sure you've seen many of these if you're a Transformers fan. And if those that are watching, that probably made you all very excited right now. <laughs> um, or maybe a bit worried, or both. But still, I'm going to try my best, because I haven't tried anything like this in my life. But, um, yeah, the project, I, um, you know, I kind of took inspiration to uh, one of my buddies, Scott. Yeah, shout out to Scott. Um, he, um, well, both him and Merle have made a few uh, stop motions here and there. Um, Scott is, ma is um, mainly... Um, an editing genius, because um, he knows a lot more about the editing than I do. And, um, this is going to sound really disappointing, but uh, the editing stuff that I use for my, uh, um, my Comic-Con videos, I shamefully admit that I use iMovie. <laughs> and that is sad, because that's like the only somewhat editing software I have. And it's an app on my phone. <laughs> Which is what I'm using to record right now. So that's kind of sad. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, that's what I'm using for my Comic Con videos. <laughs> and that is very disappointing. But, um, aside from that, um, the idea is, um, uh, once my buddies have the time, um, I can, uh, Ask them what I ask them what characters they want to voice as, and so the characters I've listed out. Um, I actually got a few other projects in mind that I kind of was kind of on a brainwave of ideas, but uh, a few. Uh, I'm just going to list them all out the best I can. Well, but the best I can remember. Um, from, oh, what are the names again? Uh, some of the projects, um, that I've had in mind. Uh, this is the main one here. The one that I've been teasing. Um, it is called Project Devastator. And, um, that, you kind of, you can kind of get the idea of where that's going. Um, but the idea is, um, they're based on Cybertron, you know, wars going around, all that. And... They're trying to create a combiner. And if I'm not mistaken from, I think, isn't, uh, yeah, I think uh, Devastator is like the first combiner in the show. And um, so I'm trying to reference off that a little bit. And if I'm wrong, please correct me because I, I haven't um, really done all my research on the, uh, 
combiner lore as much. Um, I do remember the first um, combiner I've seen was Devastator, so I'm just going to run with that. And um, for those that are wondering, they are going to be the Studio Series. Um, I don't have any of the um, uh, Revenge of the Fallen uh, mainline figures. I, I did have a few, but I gave those away when I was younger. So, basically, basically the idea is they're trying to create the miner and try to wreak all sorts of havoc. And, you know, devastating, doing devastating things. No pun intended. Um, the other project that I have in mind, um, is called Nest Infiltration. The store... Uh, the Nest Files Infiltration. Hmm. Or um, just Nest Infiltration in general. Which, um, I do have the three uh, Nest uh, Studio Series figures. Uh, both, uh, not both. Um, Bone Crusher, Ratchet, and Bumblebee. And um, I'm going to try to come up with something um, around that line. Um, the other one is called uh, Transformers Execution, which is uh, kind of a tale or kind of a, a reference off of Age of Extinction. Not a bad film, just it, there's a lot of things that could be better in there, mainly the storyline, but still. Um, I don't have all the characters for that yet. Um, well, not that one either, I mean. Um... I am meeting uh, the rest of the Asia Extinction Studio Series line, which is um, uh, Studio Series 79 Bumblebee and uh, Grimlock, uh, Stinger, KSI Boston Century, Shadow Raider, and uh, Lockdown. So I'm in need of seven. <laughs> but uh, I do have Drift and Galvatron taken care of, so that's one less worry. And uh, this other project is called uh, Stories of World War II, or Transformers Stories of World War II, which is going to feature, uh, I'm just going to call them D2 and ZB7, you know, if, if you, and for context, uh, Hot Rod is uh, D2, Bumblebee is ZB7. I don't have uh, World War II Bumblebee yet, but I do have Hot Rod, so eventually I'll work my way up from there. And keep in mind that not all the stories are going to be interlinked. Um, some are going to, but not all of them. Uh, the other one is called uh, Alliance Zero, which is going to feature the Rise of the Beast mainline uh, figures. Uh, the characters I have are Optimus Prime, Wheeljack, um, Primal Cheetor and Rhinox, and Nightbird. So I'm just going to need Air Razor, Bumblebee, and Mirage to complete the whole set. Now we're ready to roll. And um, this other project, um, one of the last ones, uh, is called Last of Cybertron. Which is going to be like a little, uh, again, another little reference to, not Age of Extinction, but a reference to the, the Last Night. Which is on the, like, it's not bad but it's also not good but i do appreciate uh dragon storm that that is a good design but um basically it's gonna try to um, it's it's kind of i'm gonna try to reference it off of um you know the, the end of the world type of stuff or cybertron falling apart some something around those lines but um but yeah, the the stories are uh, well. The story is that uh, there's I got a few projects in mind, and uh, they're they're all gonna take time. So yeah, you have to bear with me just a little bit. But you know, I've been uploading like once a month now. So I've been uploading well again. I've been uploading once a month, so that's really nothing new to y'all. But still, um, it's gonna take a little bit more time considering um what I've got. Um, I will try to get a, a stop motion app in 
because that's the best I can do because I don't have any, you know, streaming sets or anything. So that's the best of, that's the best I've got. But um anyway, yeah, that's um that's uh, most of the projects I got in mind. Now, this new one that I literally just now thought of. Um, oh, God, what am I going to call it? It's something related to Beast Wars. Um, I think we'll call it... Um, d Ooh, there it is. It's, it's probably going to sound a little, um, maybe a little lame to some people. I got a few names. A uh, few name. one of the few names I got, um, is, um, Dis Dimension Disruption. Um, actually, here's what we do. Um, after uh, I upload this, I'm going to have a little post. Or a little poll system, and I'm gonna let you guys decide of um, which uh, which name sounds better: Beast Wars Dimension Disruption or um, Timeline Terror. Actually, no, not Timeline Terror. Um, God. Yeah, I'll, I'll think of something. I'll, I'll have a poll system up for it. But, um, yeah. The, that's, um, it's gonna feature the Beast Wars characters if that wasn't apparent enough. Um, uh, I just, I still need to collect a few here and there, but, um, uh, again, it, things are gonna take time with those projects, so bear with me. And, again, I've, I haven't done anything like this at all, so if things are gonna look a little shoddy or just straight up, um, a train wreck in some aspects it just you all have to bear with because that's that's the best i've got and i barely got any space either so well i do have some spaces but i just need them i just need to find the right one that works but um with that being said i'm gonna end this video here and i'm gonna grab myself some coffee because i am still trying to wake up but, um, well, trying to fight off the tiredness, really. But, um, with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed this video in some aspect. And if you and if you did, then you already know the drill. Hit that like button. Hit that... Well, let me try that again. You guys know the drill. Like, subscribe, hit that bell notification there, and comment down below what other things you think I should do. Uh, maybe some, uh, some other uh, figure laid stuff. Maybe, like, um... Uh, I got some WWE, I got some WWE stuff and AEW stuff I can uh, fiddle around here and there, so you know I could probably start some there. But again, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.